Hey guys, this is Garys. Welcome back to another episode of Survival Without. As you can see by our screen and the title of the video, we are once again back in Direwolf 20. So, uh, before we get started, I just want to say Happy New Year to everybody. This should have gone out the 1st of January. So, let's go for it. So, also this server, we are going to go to a server again. So, I just set up, finished setting it up. This is a whitelisted server. So, only whitelisted people can join unfortunately i'm not going to have a public server it takes too much resources and costs a little bit too much so unfortunately i have to be whitelisted to join us in this server and for that you need to be a patreon subscriber to my of my channel or however and um, links is down in the description on my website and on youtube's main page of my channel so if you want to join the server feel free to be a patron and you'll get access <clears throat> okay so without further ado <clears throat> excuse me without further ado let's join the server so i'm prepared a little okay and we're in as i was trying to say i think uh, the recording lags but when i'm loading in um i made a little bit of a starting area in this season or in this server so since yes okay so the inside of the starting area i don't know why we spawn on top of them this hut thingy and um, i said spawn right here so maybe it doesn't like it maybe i must make this higher oh well we'll see so i gave a little bit of instructions on what to do and how to do it just want to take this away Okay, so I've set up warps in all the wind directions, or main wind directions, north, south, east, west, and north, east, south, west, uh, north, west, and south, east. I think I got all of them. So you can warp to any of those directions, and it's 2,000 blocks away. So um, since we have issues with portals connecting, um, we're just trying to go as far away as possible into different directions so you can choose which direction and go look for a place to build a base over there <clears throat> so um i think i thought this would make it easier than just to run around for forever in a day just to try and find a place um, spawn is a thing so i just put it here for new players so um, going to spawn brings you back here and just the same instructions that's on discord just put it here to make a home for yourself so i don't think we'll use that um it feels a little bit cheaty but for me um i think we need to use the teleporting things okay i think it's sun setting so i don't know which direction we should choose so let's come in here and we're going to spin around uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, okay. And, okay, we stop there, so let's go in this direction. Funsies, northwest, let's go. North, north, west. Oh, nice. Okay, so we might die since it's night time or yeah so I, I made a portal or a warp spot in any place and it's protected so you can't break these blocks yeah I unfortunately can still break the signs so hopefully nobody does that um okay so it's a stony area uh, maybe we should go back to spawn till it's daytime so let me bring it back once it's daytime Okay, we're back in and it's daytime already. Okay, so um, I think let's do over here what I want to do over our at our new location. But the problem is over there, there it's not a very flat. And I see over here it's quite flat. So we need to do a few things. So there is a awesome mod on here. Um, it's the what? monk mod monk so you can a to z go to monk monk mod okay so no more information is given here but what it does is it focuses on your 
body basically so you can run faster you can eat harder etc so i can't remember where you start off i think you start off with um, breaking down trees so let's break down a tree you'll see it if it works at the bottom right corner is where the thing will pop up that shows if we're actually busy progressing with that so we are going to start with a monk mod and then slowly work our way on also this um, season or series is going to be a long running one not just the D or odd um, number of episodes we are going to try and keep it going for a couple of months so that we can do a lot of things and actually live up to our overdone name okay so let's see let's break down some wood yes bottom right corner look popped up okay great i can't remember how many it is i think it was 10 or 5 10 maybe about that progress bar looks about 10 ish also this season i'm going to assume everybody knows how to craft things so i'm not going to spend a lot of time on crafting i'm going to try and spend the least amount of time on crafting maybe just basic and small things um, no. need that big tree a big tree takes forever so once you get this yes monk level one okay now we can look into i just want to finish this tree we can look at the advancements you have to unlock it first before it picks up in your advancements okay advancements way of a monk oh way of a square fist sorry okay so way of a square fist with your bare hands the world will bend so monk level one break 10 wood logs with your bare hands and then you get wooden hands your hands can now quickly break wooden blocks without, <coughs> without tools strength your bare hands do 100 percent extra damage okay monk level two meditate while watching a sunset or a sunrise that would have happened now Okay, so while we do that, let's get a few sheep going. Need a couple of these. Okay, and also some objectives for this season. We're not going to use Tinker's Construct except for a crafting station. And we're also not going to use um, Britannia for their armor. And we're not going to use Tinker's Construct for its weapons and stuff weapons and tools so we are going to try and um, do without let's make a sword no what I think you can make wooden shears is it not nope that's uh, in revelations unfortunately there is one or two nice things about different mods okay and then we get morph as well so we can morph into various things i can't remember how to add morph to your quick help okay, i shouldn't actually not be killing for spider um for sheep on a at spawn not hopefully they'll respawn again to come and give me one more there we go we can make a bed we can s watch the sunrise it's a sunrise or a sunset right or sunrise yes we can watch the sunset and maybe get the weather going so let's wait for sunset or sunrise and i'll bring it back in a sec Okay, I'm not sure if we'll catch this, but... Oh yes, look at the bottom right. We can catch it. Sorry, that might have been too late. Oh, come on. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It's going, it's going, it's going, it's going. It's going, it's going, it's going, it's going, it's going. It's going. Yes, we got it. <laughs> Great, let's sleep quickly. Then we can continue. Monk level 2, got it. Go. now rain should stop and then mr skeleton should go bye bye okay let's quickly check the uh, next advancement 
Meditate. Swim until your lungs nearly burst. Okay, that's easy. Swim until your lungs nearly burst. Okay, so... We're swimming and we're swimming. Just basically standing still. Got it. Easy. Now I think we can stay longer underwater. Oh wow. Yeah, we need uh, enchantments. Okay, next level. Break five stone blocks with your bare hands. Okay, so usually when you do that, you lose stone blocks, which is fine, I don't mind. And this should make five. Got it. Nice. Let's see. Okay. Oh, let's see what the thing says. So, the meditate sunset and sunrise. Fasting your hunger will deplete fifty percent slow. Oh, that's nice. Thick skin. Your skin is naturally armored. Uh, but the swim thing is deep breaths. You can swim for much longer. Thick skin. Your skin is naturally armored. Oh, that's two times. This one is stone. Your hands dig with the hardness and speed of stone tools. That's cool. Pay 20 animals. Right click an animal with an empty hand. And this is uh, why I needed to the flat area. We need to sprint for 200 blocks. Okay, well, stone tools. That means we'll get cobblestone if we break this. Yep, there you go. Cobblestone. Awesome. Okay. Pet 20 animals. Let's see, there's animals right over here. Okay, right click, chicken love. Come on. Oh, you know what? Oh, sorry. Big. I think I have done a few of these pets before. I've um, this is a world that I tested out first, so I tested out the whole monk thing before starting out. So I think that's why some of the bits doesn't work. Okay, that one worked. That one worked. I did it, um, delete my... Come on rabbit, come on rabbit. <laughs> Rabbit worked! <laughs> okay, didn't know it will work. Um, I did delete my, my advancements, but for some reason it seems some items keep keep um, in the advancements for some reason. Come on. Give me more. There's a black rabbit to the right. Let's see if we can get it. Probably not. How oh, we can. <laughs> I did not know you can do this to rabbits. Another rabbit. How far are we? Okay, well you see what we need to do there is a few chickens. Oh, another black rabbit. Come here rabbit. I think I got it. A few chickens. Oh, this one is taken. That one is not. Except if somebody else did this one, maybe. Maybe, maybe not. Ooh, creeper. Let's go better creeper. <laughs> yeah, no. Not going to happen. There we go. Achievement made. So now, if you right click, they will make a baby. So you don't need food to do that anymore. That's super awesome. Okay. The parrots and the bats, <laughs> birds and the bees. <laughs> Interesting. So let's just see what that one makes. Animal friend. Pet animals with an empty hand to calm them down or to make them fall in love. Your skin is naturally armored. Nice. Sprint 200 blocks. Okay. So let's start sprinting. Okay. We have progress bar at the top, uh, bottom right. Sorry. 
and I think that's all that we can do for where we are. Oh, the next one we have to dodge skeleton shooting at us. Oh, and I think you don't have to have armor on. But I think we need to have a base and a respawn point before we do that, actually. There we go. Look at that speed. And this is the one I want. So now we can go out and to go look for our base. Swiftness. You run 40% faster. Jump. You can jump 20% higher. Your bare hands do 200% extra damage. Nice. This is a light. 10 hostiles enemies to rest and this one is dodge skeleton arrows five times in a row without getting hit okay so let's go where did we say northeast right it was northwest i can't remember where did we say we're going to do all right we can just always choose a new one yep northwest okay but I want to keep to where we said we need to start. So now we can find a base location easier. Okay. Let's go in this direction. Why not? So this will help a bunch for us that. Ooh. Since we're not going to do the. Um, Britannia armors or Tinker stuff. Tinker tools and weapons. So we are going to go full on in their IO. Okay, let me go. I'm looking for a nice greenish area, greenish area. So let me see if I can find. Oh, and we have actual additions again. Yes, MB, yes. It's an awesome mod to have. Okay. So let me go and look for that and I'll bring you in a second. Okay, I think we traveled way far enough. Oh wow, <laughs> Journey Map doesn't even want to update yet. But uh, we are X2 minus 2300 away and Z minus 3000 away. And it looks like we have something here some greenery and so on so we might be able to make something here so it's not as green as I usually like but I've traveled overseas literally oceans crossed oceans for this so I'm not sure if I want to be a little bit or even a, a tad more picky <laughs> because yeah traveled a, f a lot I do want to be picky to be honest yeah. let's see here's a birch forest does look like we are having some more um, train generation this side Hmm. Okay, let me go a little bit more. Um, as I said, I want to be a little bit more picky. I want to find a nice spot. We don't have to maybe move again <laughs> during our stay. Well, we can always. So a few mods that makes moving fun as well. So, but let's see if we can find anything better. Ah, oh, perfect. <laughs> This is usually not too bad. Let's just see if we can find a spot that's a clear area. But this is usually good. Because it's dark green. Oh no, not that way. Ugh. Otherwise we'll just do some deforestation over here. Uh, I think that's a way to go. Wait, 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 wait. Perfecto. Right in between everything. We found our spot. Okay. Get out. 
some space. What drink type of drink is this? This is interesting. Small piece of planes in the tomb. Okay. Let's chop down a tree or five. Okay, we just chopped down two trees, but <laughs> with this dark oak, that's more than enough. Sky of beginning. Oh, that's Britannia. Where is Britannia? There it is. Anyway, okay, so where are we going to start? How are we going to do this? So we are going to have a forest open, I think. Um, let's just make a temporary house like we usually do. Um, make a bunch of blanks. What are we going to throw it? Let's throw it cotton. Okay, let's take it down one more. We need to get tools. We need to get to cobblestone and actually make better tools and then get to iron. And go up from there. As I was saying, I'm skipping Tinker's Construct. That is... Oh, that's going to be tough for me. I usually do that quite quickly in game or early in game because there's ore doubling it gives you awesome weapons and tools and all those fun stuff which we can't do now uh, so yes okay let's see if we can just get a basic wooden house going for a f for an initial start we should be good Let's go two more. Okay, so now that I see all this fruit and vegetable stuffs, there is one thing that I still want to get from Britannia though. One, two, one, two, three. That is the um, Horn of a Wild and maybe the Sash or a Ring or two. We'll see. I don't know. <laughs> None of those two is actually better than the no. other. Go away, Cal. You'll get your drawn soon enough. Okay, I'm not going to get too much for... Oh, you know what? This one thing I didn't see. It's a village. Usually you see a village or two. Okay, what I was saying is I'm not going to get too much for a window or two. Let's do that. Of course, at this moment in time, I don't really mind just climbing on top of our things and checking over wall if there's danger. Put our craft table. Let's put it where we always put it, right at the door. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, seven. Okay, nice seven by seven area. It's perfect for a small house. Okay, spawn set. Yeah, this. Let's make a couple of chests. You know what? Here is a crate that you can do. Crate. Uh, four chests. This do we need to make this. Okay, so we need a couple of sticks. Can we make no missing this one? Now 
we should be able to craft one. Fun. What are we shorting for another crate? Another wooden block. Here we go. Okay, and let's just dump everything. We'll sort out everything later. Oh no, uh, books and stuff. Let's just put it here. Let's pick up all the things. And it's almost night time. So I think this is a good time to call it an episode. I'm going to go down. Um, somewhere there's a cave area. Where is that? No, oh, it's just this. I thought it was a cave. There's a cave. Fish area. So, I'll go down and just mine a couple of metals. And then I'll bring you back in the next episode. But for now, I think we're going to call it. Thank you once again for joining me in this first new episode of this first season of this new year 2021 so hopefully this year is a little bit better last year was tough with the COVID and lockdowns and all that worldwide um, was a tough year for everybody so i hope this year is much better just want to make a door oh and we have better doors now that we have this stuff. So, awesomeness. Already slipped. So, but once again, I'm going to call, you, call it an episode here, guys. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers!